could it be? Don't mind if I do. for his condition. And in return, Bruce is supposed to behave. But I guess with Bruce gone, he's back in the game. What have you got, Sam? Judging from the list of stolen items, I'd say he's looking to upgrade his exosuit. And that's just for starters. He also downloaded local weather balloon data for the past 10 years. Let's go back out there and stop Breeze before he kills anyone else. Easy, Tiger. We'll get him. Maybe that's enough practice for today. I've set the back computer to monitor the city for high concentrations of cryogel. Meanwhile, we should keep tabs on anyone working for Freeze, which should be easy since he decks out all of his lackeys with cryo guns. Palomares said I'd be hearing from you. I'm Charlotte. You look really familiar. Do we know each other? My wife and I donate to a number of charities around town. She's quite well off. 
I'm an artist, so I didn't exactly start out that way. What brings you to the watch? I love my wife, but some of her friends, they live in a different world than the rest of us. They report the pettiest crimes and get away with far worse things themselves. But the cops won't listen to you. No. Before the watch, the only other person I could talk to was Bruce Wayne. And now he's... Bruce told me I could use my connections to actually do some good for this city. Like he did with the Martha Wayne Foundation. <laughs> and then somehow I found myself talking to Batman. And now you. Glad to have you on board. How can I help? Stay safe. That's all I got tonight. Come on over. So Alfred tells me you've been working hard on your bat gadgets. There's always room for improvement, especially when it comes to tech. But you know you're going to run into supply issues eventually, right? Necessity is the mother of invention, and I'm definitely going to need more supplies. Tell you what. You keep busy with your superhero business, and I'll keep you supplied with components. You good with that? It's a deal. Thanks, Mr. Fox.